baobab, a tree that stretches up and up and out over the African landscape, dwarfing its deciduous neighbors. A presence so imposing that it's also generated its own legends. According to one story, long, long ago, the baobab had an ego as big as its branches. It considered itself to be so superior to the other trees that the gods decided to teach it a lesson. They uprooted the baobab and planted it upside down, where it remains. The legend earning the baobab the nickname, the Upside Down Tree. To me, the baobab is a work of art, a sculpture to be admired. And so one day in Kenya's Savo East National Park, I drove around just looking for trees to photograph, ignoring the wildlife that had brought me to the park in the first place. As a bonus, sometimes the wildlife and the trees were in the same location. The baobab's enormous canopy providing a shady escape from the African sun. The baobab does more than cast a giant shadow. It's also a source of life. Water and food for many animals, from tiny insects to large elephants. 80% of its trunk can be made of water up to 1,200 gallons of water in a single tree. In the dry season, when there's no rain, when the rivers and ponds have dried up, elephants and humans can survive with the help of the baobab and its succulent-like trunk. No wonder it's called the tree of life. It's estimated the baobab has more than 300 uses. It produces a fruit, being dubbed a superfruit, high in calcium, 50% higher than spinach, high in iron, potassium, and 10 times the vitamin C of fresh oranges. Its leaves can be cooked and eaten as spinach and boiled to make traditional medicines. The bark can be used to weave rope and cloth, and the baobab is also a source of soap, rubber, and glue. Again, more than 300 products useful to humans from this ancient tree that first appeared more than 200 million years ago long before there were any humans on the planet. The average baobab is thought to live about 800 years, with some estimated to be 2,500 to 3,000 years old. They can grow to more than 100 feet tall. But it's their girth that's most impressive. Some trunks so big it would take 20 people with arms outstretched to encircle the tree. trunks have been hollowed out to use as houses, a post office, a wine cellar and bar, a shop, a bus shelter, and a prison. Despite its impressive size and history of survival, the tree is under threat from climate change. Nine of Africa's 13 oldest and largest baobab trees have died in the past decade. Massive and ancient, but not invincible. Valuable and generous with its resources, the tree of life for 200 million years may now need our help to survive.